Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. I just wanted to pop on with a quick video to show you another great update that's been added to your Design Files account. Now this new update is gonna make it really quick and easy for you to manage your contact list for both your clients and your vendors. So let's go ahead. We're gonna pop into the contact section right here and I'm gonna show you how this works. Now, if you haven't been using the contact section within your design files account, this is where you can input all of your clients information. So you have everything organized in one location. And if you already have a long list of clients and you want to add all of those clients to your design files account, but you don't want to spend the time to add each client one at a time, that's totally understandable. So what we've done here is we have created the option to import your entire contact list as a CSV. So if you already have your contact list all set up and you've got it broken down into the appropriate columns, what you can now do is you can go to your client list. You can save your client list as a CSV. So you want to make sure you select this option. When you do that and you save that to your computer, you can then pop back over to your design files account and you can choose to import your CSV. So if I click this button right here, I'll be able to select my file. And then what's going to happen is the system is going to automatically pull all of the titles for each column that you added to your client list. And then it's going to give you the opportunity to map that information to the appropriate columns within your design files account. So what you want to do is you're going to click into each and every one of these fields and you're going to pick the version that best maps to your original uh, column titles within your client uh, file. So here we've got name, so I'm going to pick full name and then I'm just going to make my way through it. So we'll go for email, first name, last name, phone number, country, for region, I can do province or state, and for city, okay, street one, I'm just gonna do address one. So again, we're just mapping to the closest version. And then I'm gonna do postal code, and for notes, this one's actually not available yet within this new functionality, but we are bringing it in soon. So we'll be sure to notify you when it's ready. For now, I'm just gonna leave this as none. Then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hit save and I can close this down and you'll see that my clients have been added into the appropriate columns. All the information is organized and I'm able to automate this whole process instead of wasting the time to add an individual client one at a time and all of their individual details as well. Now, of course, you can make any edits over here. If you do need to edit client information, you can add notes and you can delete a client at any time. And on the flip side, if you're using an email marketing platform like MailChimp and you want to export your entire client list so that you can import it into that um, email marketing software and send marketing messages, all you have to do is click the button right here to export your CSV. It's going to download it to your computer, at which point you can then go ahead and add it to any of the uh, marketing software that you're using. So there you have it. This is uh, the latest update that we've added to your design files account. If you are needing to add clients to your design files account and you don't want to waste the time to painstakingly type that information in one at a time, go ahead, try the new import option where you can import your entire client list. Let us know what you think. And as always, thanks for watching.